greetings and a good afternoon or good evening uh, live from the swap swap a money swap eh? swap swap uh, football village in kansas uh, missouri uh, so leo mazeni ko privilege kuwa na one of kenya's finest exports atakuwa anatueleza in a short while and introduce to and then of course very very shortly or very soon atakuwa anafanya interview exclusively on uh, on of course on our show which is champion baba greetings greetings how are you doing bro good good you good yeah, thank you man. thanks for having me niko poa kuna usinichanganye na english of the nose ah jitambulisha bro ah mimi naitwa Lawrence Alum used to play professional saizi still in the game as a coach so different uh, roles oh different roles but still in the game you just come on up and again lazima ubaki kwa game lazima ubaki kwa game yeah eh take me through on what levels have you played back home have you played any football at home ah have you been born here bred here <laughs> born in kenya yeah, okay live here so i was born in kenya yeah. uh nikasoma mpaka high school chemili academy alafu at uh, 18 nilipata chance ya kukuja US on a scholarship and the uh, Toyo scholarship or no no oh no this was different uh Missouri Baptist Kiko St Louis Missouri it was just it happened that uh, they had uh, one of their scouts uko and I let me offer you a chance na nikaweza kuitumia so what age was that uh, this was uh, I was 18 years old 18 years yeah, old yeah this is back in what 2003 really yeah so you've been here for like how many years 21 Eh, unafanya na kanikazi ni mingi ni mingi na ni mzee jo lakini <laughs> but yeah for yeah. about 20 years so size full citizenship in america Apa- or you same dual citizenship kenyan and american kenyan ni home always ukuja kenya unatoa passport ya kenya ukuja us unatoa us pale inasaidika pale inasaidika how lucky are you bro <laughs> you played in the mls yes never played in the kpl no eh uh, it- how do you compare the two leagues Eh, ku, I, I don't know much about the Kucheza in Kenya mm. but uh ni mm. at, at that level ni mm. but uh siwezi ongea sana juu yake but I've I've, no, I've met some really good players in Kucheza huko mm. so ina maanisha iko na iko na capabilities zake of producing really good players mm. and the number ndio ina need to increase I think Yeah, you have your experience because uh, I'm sure you've attended uh, several and I'm you are used to the 20th edition ama sivi edition yeah 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 so that way back in 2009 yes yes how many have you attended uh, especially as a Kenyan oh. professional <laughs> so i attended the inaugural one nilikuwa but over those 15 years mm. Uh, nimekuwa nikicheza actively yeah. so it was very hard to actually come and yeah. ama participate yeah. but usually if it was imekuwa hapa in Kansas City uh, I've always uh, showed up na nime you know yeah. nime represent and all that so yeah. this is something that nilikuwa since its uh, uh, conception yeah. and is something nime watch it grow and yeah. participate so it is something we are very uh, very proud of player of uh, high uh, profile like yourself uh, today we had a chance to play together uh, there's only one captain amban yes for each side uh-huh. wewe ukachukua band uh-huh. ukasema bram uh-huh. vai kitu bana ndio mchezaji kama wewe experience ndio ah. uko nataka tu tupige boli ya biashara tu ni lazima bado unapiga ile katono katono experience ilikuwaaje bro ilikuwa bora bibi yaani wewe yaani ninge kupata gas zangu ni kwa boli niko na wewe mahali hapo tuko wire to any position eh uh-huh. alai tuko na uwa mati bado tunaweza sinajua hipo si mnasai ndio hipo si mnasai kuja mtai unaingia hipo si ndio hiyo sasa ah very fast good stuff ndio uh, maybe your final thoughts about uh, the mls especially right now that uh, players like messi are moving in players like busquets mm-hmm. one of the most decorated midfielders in the world uh, we are hearing rumors of uh, maybe suarez uh, linking up with Messi mm-hmm. at Inter Miami. Miami. Yeah. Your thoughts on that? Well, it shows that this league is growing. Mm. 
uh, a league that actually started in 96, 1996. Yep. So it's maybe 20, what, wait, I take that back. Like 27 years old. Yeah. In the league Changa, mm. that's a very young league mm. in comparison to all these other leagues. Mm. But for them to be able to attract mm. players like Messi, Brusquets, it tells you that they are, they are doing something that is really good. Mm. So you can only say I've, I've, I've been around this league for about 10 mm. and every day it grows. Every day. Mm. You look at the Kama, this facility where we are, mm. this, is, this belongs to Sporting Kansas City, the yeah. team that I used to play for. Yeah. We have about 10 fields and this is not their only facility. They have like four others around the city. Yeah. This is only for the academy teams mm. that mm. play here. So imagine 30 teams are going to come as brand new stadiums everywhere. So it's a league that is really growing really fast. Yeah. So you can only speak good things about it. Yeah. Uh, it did me well, yeah. had a lot of good things about it. So yeah. it's a really, it can only get, can better. Only get better. I, if you give it some time. Your thoughts on Kenyan football in general? Administratively, maybe, from a player's perspective? I, I never had, to be honest. I When I used to be with the Kenya team, I went through, uh, I think it was Sam Yamwe, who was the federation president. Yeah. Yeah. So, personally, I never had anything negative to say, but I think with the stories that I've heard and with friends I've experienced, I think uh, there's room to grow. There's room to grow in every aspect of the game. Grow. What, when you say there's room to grow, mm -hmm. we've been growing since the days of uh, maybe probably Joe Bomino, mm -hmm. Peter Kenneth. Right. We're still growing, bro. It's time to evolve. True. And that is the part of growth. Sometimes maybe something drastic has to happen. Yeah. I'm uh, not drastic in the sense of, but there should be a change in the way people do things like that. That is the only Definitely, way. we all agree that yeah. there should be a change in how people do things. Mm -hmm. Some of you have lived and experienced a different kind of management system. Mm -hmm. Especially, we can borrow a lot from the American system. Right. Why don't you guys, maybe, with your influence and maybe your financial muscle, mm -hmm. whatever it is, Bonham Sirudi home, you take up the mantle. I, I think it is. Have you ever thought about it? Like, like we said, anytime you in the game, you want to stay in the game. Yeah. So, as now I'm at the coaching level, yeah. uh, I used to think as a player, now I'm a coach. Maybe that could be the next step. You never know. So right now you're thinking as a coach. As a coach now. We don't know. You never know. We're still young. Olum, uh, shukran sana. Shukran baba. Short and sweet. Thank you. I'll see you on the other side. Thank you very much. Man. Thanks for passing me the, the captain's armband hey, today. Hey, it you. was a pleasure playing with you in the same team. You deserved it, man. Abba <laughs> <laughs> Shukran, shukran, shukran baba. Sana. Thanks, bro. Shukran. Awatuangwa, vika, dola, vika, zimu, abba.